Stroud rolling, looking that way, retreating, and he'll just throw it out of the back of the end zone. There was heavy pressure. Actually, a flag comes out. I thought it was going to be way beyond the end line. Harrison worked his way back and actually made a play on the ball and is down on the field. That ball was fluttering and I thought had no chance to be completed. Harrison being attended to by the athletic training staff. It, somehow that ball almost came down in bounds on the back end. I thought it was with you. I, it was fluttering. Personal foul. Targeting. Defense number 22. Half the distance to the goal. Automatic first down. The play is under review. Of course they'll review it. That's Javon Bullard. An enormous play. Instead of an incompletion, this would set up Ohio State in the first and goal. Kirby bringing everybody. He's just trying to buy time. Watch this ball doesn't go into the stands. It's on the back line. And there's the hit right there. I mean, he's on the back line. He steps out, but he's trying to make a play. Then the big hit by Bullard. And that's where the flag came in. Looks like he hit him with his shoulder pad. Terry Layden, the Pac-12 crew, will take a look at this one. Now, there was the helmet to helmet that time. A replay took this targeting rule off. It's not rule targeting. Your thoughts? I agree with replay. I do not have targeting. He is defenseless. It was close to contact to the head neck area, but it was more to the shoulder. I did not see his head spin back from it. Thank you for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+.